so what's happening I'm on the sofa indoors bit of an echo but it's windy outside I'm limited on time to get this episode six out Hans and Gretel we left it that they wanted to explore a th or she wanted to explore a threesome and he had populated his laptop she'd helped him set all his banks up and it was all good now next more up uh, same day because they'd done that in the morning set the laptop up money transfer he'd made it obvious the day before that he wanted lots of stuff in the house she said to him do you want to spend all this money on furniture in the house what if we get on and decide to move to a better house will the furniture fit the better house so he said well if we buy the right furniture this house is okay this is only my first week in Thailand uh, we can always buy more but I would like to get it all set up and she's agreed she said right you need to get money over from Germany get it here so you've got money in the bank also the type of uh, visa you want you want a retirement visa you need money for that I've researched it and you have as well and he said yes at this moment in time the requirements for him to get the he's got a non-immigrant O visa to convert it to a visa extension for one year he needs 800,000 baht in the bank Thai bank for three months uh, two months for his first first one so she says well you need to get that because your visa is only 90 days at the moment you need to get it here now so it's in for two months you've got two bank accounts now we've opened up the one which is the Thai bank in Thai funny writing where he's got a book and he can't even read his own name and he's got the Grung C so he says well is it best to put the use the, the Thai bank account to keep the money in and use my Grung C for every day and she says I think so because the Thai account is Thai and it's all we, you don't touch it you'll just leave your money in there emergency money visa money etc he said okay how do I get the money over to that Thai bank for that and then money to my Grung C do I bring it all to one and move it she goes no now you've set it up on the laptop you can send straight to the one bank straight to the other let's do it she said you know you need 800,000 baht so put a million baht in the Thai account and he says okay let's do that so they go online it's a lot of money um, he starts filling it all in she fills in the details for the Thai account and is asking for verification um, emails etc so he goes through all that and yep yeah, three to five days orders a million baht from his German account to come into the uh, Thai account done and it comes off his German bank total so then she says right so that will be there in a few days you'll it'll be two months in that account at least two months so be no problem for the visa we can do that about two weeks before your 90-day visa runs out and he said yes that's that will be fine I've already researched that he said right now you need money for furniture in the house how much are we going to spend what do you think it's going to all cost and they've been looking at bits and pieces and from what he told her she said I think you're going to need to spend a hundred hundred and twenty five thousand baht on bits and pieces and he said I agree she says but rather than keep bringing bits over you ought to just bring a lump of money over is it earning money in your German bank and he said not really the interest rate's so low she said well it won't be earning any here either but would you rather not have your money well the exchange rate and it was 51 baht at this moment have it the exchange rate seems to be good why don't you bring it over a lump of it as in what you've got over there 
And he says, I, I don't want to bring it all over, I want to keep some back, he said, but that'll leave him five million baht in the German bank. He said, I'll bring three over. She says, okay. So in they go, three million baht to Grungsi. Two to five days there's. But there is, because of the amount, with verification, there's an option there to accelerate it. Um, and it's not too much money. It's not much difference. So he goes for the acceleration, which is one day, does all the verifications, and they even send him text to his phone, <coughs> which he'd set up when he first did it. Sorted that, three million baht is on the way. So he's left two million baht back in Germany. One million baht to the Thai bank, and three million to the Grungsi. And the other bits of money he's already spent, he had a bit of savings as well. So, wind picking up. She knows exactly what money he's got. She's got all the passwords and everything. She's not touched it, she's good as gold. She's an angel. He's now feeling confident, he knows about his visa. He's got his new laptop, he's on top of all his money in his bank, everything's fine. She said, right, we won't go, um, the bed's coming today. In fact, it was going to due in the next few hours. She said, tomorrow we'll maybe go and start buying furniture and things. And he said, yeah. And he said, I also like a gardener, because I can't garden, it's too hot here, but we maybe get a gardener to tidy the garden up. She said, oh, I know somebody. She says, we also need to do the health insurance. She says, we've got a few numbers already. Let's do a bit more research while we're waiting for the bed. So they go through all that again. And they find that uh, the one company seems to be quite good, but he's going to need a medical. Um, and he'll have to pay for the medical himself and pay for the health insurance up front and can get the medical money back once they've accepted him. So she says, that's what we need to do, but we'll again wait till the money comes and uh, then we'll take that out, sort that out. Perfect. A couple of hours go past, bed arrives, all the furniture. Guys come, deliver it, build it, set it up. All done. The old uh, bed, they move into the spare bedroom. So, she's like, right, I think it's time. Let's just bite the bullet with the sexual activity, she said. I'm keen to explore all of this. It's been many years, I'm comfortable around you, and I think we should try some stuff. And he's still... Well, I really, as you said, all you do is sit and watch. Don't do anything. Want to join in, you can. We want to see the reaction to see if maybe this will help your um, body stand to attention and start working again. And he said, oh, I don't know. She said, look, a girl I know, she's a tomboy. Um, her name's Leia. Lay her there, and I've already spoken briefly to her. She's up for it, and I'm actually going to give her a little money to help her so that it makes it more worthwhile for her. And you, you mean you pay for a woman? She said, Well, yeah, but she's a friend of a friend, and it's okay. It's I want to explore with a proper woman who knows what they're doing, and let's see what happens. He goes, I'm going to set it up. He goes, let me just sort the bedroom out, all the new sheets and everything. We've got a Chris in the bed, or I've got a Chris in the bed. And he's like, he's only been in Thailand three days, and his new girlfriend is bringing another girl around, Leia. A couple of hours go past, they eat food, knock on the door, it's Leia. Girl comes in, short, black hair, looks like a boy. It's a Tom girl dressed like a boy, carrying a bag, and gives Gretel a hug, um, and then gives Hans a hug. 
she doesn't speak English, she's rabbiting away in Thai and Hans is like, oh, and it's about eight, nine at night. Gretel grabs Hans' hand, <laughs> pulls him upstairs, come on, and up goes Leia as well, into the bedroom, music on, bedside lights on, lights off, Hans in his chair, he's now got his own cockpit of a chair, an armchair. Uh, and the girls just strip off and the girl named Leia takes control, pulls all sorts of toys out of the bag. I'm not going to go into all the details but they romped around the bed, aerobics and Hans watched with a smile on his face. Um, it didn't make any difference to his body and the girls then even came across to him and started handling hands and he's like nah, nothing happening and then they carry on and a good couple of hours and he's um, into his solo aerobics again with not a lot happening poor guy Gretel had a great time Leia had a great time, Hans had a great time and uh, then bedtime. Leia stayed, Hans same bed, three of them in a bed, nothing made any difference, the night passed, Hans woke up solo <laughs> and got up and left the girls to have a play before breakfast. Eventually coming down, breakfast, little bit of money changes hands and Gretel says goodbye to Leia. Kiss on the cheek, kiss on the cheek for hands. Off she goes. It's the next morning. Gretel says to Hans, what did you think? He said it was wonderful. I really enjoyed watching. It stimulated me in a different way, but sadly, my fishing tackle doesn't seem to be any good anymore. Whether it's because I smoke so much or I drink, I don't know whether it's a mental issue. He said, but it just doesn't work anymore. She said, did it ever work? And he said, yes, it did, but long, long time ago. She said, have you tried all the different pills available? He said, not really, no. He said, I'm a bit scared of those. I've heard so many bad stories. <laughs> anyway, it didn't work. Three in a bed. Poor old hands. Huh? Who'd guess it? It's time for a shopping spree, I think. He's very good with his laptop, moving money around the world. He's got a beautiful woman that now likes bringing other ladies into the house. How lucky is he? he? I mean, this woman's amazing. She takes care of all his money, the bills. She's going to set it all up. All nice furniture, house, cheap rent. She has girlfriends, maybe more, maybe going swingers parties. This could be the dream for, for Hans. It is the dream. Perfect dream to some. Well, what can happen? not doing any harm her having girls if his bits don't work shopping time anyway hmm let's leave it there on a high with no cliffhanger today isn't that nice of me see you on number seven bye for now <laughs> Leia did no one get that last joke millennium Millennium Falcon. Oh dear. This is a life story. And they're still sort of maybe together. They're both breathing. Both on the same planet. Are they living together? Well, I didn't say that.
And is it Gretel he's living with or on his own? So many questions. <laughs> Ta-da.